Coach, for the second straight year, starting pitching certainly is a major strength of this team. And there have been some great offensive teams here, such as 2010, but it seems to always come back to pitching. Names like Barham, Bowman, Smink. What do you attribute the success of VMI pitching over the last several years to? Well, obviously, pitching and defense wins championships. You look at any level of, of, of baseball, you know, every every great team has solid pitching. And we try to go out and, and develop that, you know. Uh, you know, this year we were returning Kobe Kogel as a Friday night starter. Last year he was not, didn't start the season as a Friday night guy um, with an injury. Then he became one and did a great job at that. Campbell Hinkle, who was a, is a sophomore this year, he's going to be predominantly our two starter as a left hander. And uh, last year he had a couple uh, spot starts, but this year we're calling him to, to be our, our every everyday Saturday guy. Um, and our three role is, I guess you would say, a Sunday starter. You know, is is Jeremy Brown, who's got significant innings and a, and a lot of time for 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 VMI baseball in his three years here, and being a senior that you can put in there on Sunday. You know, he's gonna give you an opportunity to go out there and win every Sunday. You know, I think the big thing that the the, the unknown is what's gonna happen with Adam Lopez. I mean, Adam Lopez had an injury. He looks great right now. He's coming back. You know, we're not gonna rush him. And uh, really, when he's when he's ready, it's gonna give us a a great deal of flexibility in that starting rotation. Uh, and so, you know, it's just gonna see how they how it pans out as we start the season. All right, Coach, you mentioned just about everybody who could be in line for a weekend start to uh, start the season. But what about midweek starters? Well, midweek starters right now for us, it just depends on how we how we line it up. Like I said, Adam Lopez is is on a timetable right now. He I mean he could be a midweek starter for us until he gets his gets ready and gets his pitch count up until we get him to into the weekend series. Um, you know, Reed Garrett has done a great job for us. John Garrett maybe uh, maybe another option for us. By the way, they're not related. John Garrett and Reed Garrett are not related, so. You know, we have to note that. But uh, both those guys can, can start for us. And, and really, Connor Bach was the other one we mentioned. So it just depends on, I think, who we play and who's been throwing well. I mean, we still got a couple weeks left. And, you know, we're evaluating them every outing they go out to see who would be the guy. I mean, Jonathan Kelly's shown signs in the fall that he could be a, a left-handed starter for us. So, you know, I think it just depends on how we use them on the weekends early on to how, who starts in the midweek. All right, Coach, thank you. Good luck this season. Thank you, Brad.